All right, guys, there she is. Got her home. 1965 Thunderbird Lando. Lando's for the type of top it has on it, which is pretty crappy right this second. But we'll do a walk around real quick. Go down the road. It's <clears throat> I've done some things to get it started. We got the oil tank drained. We got uh, rinsed a couple times. Filled back up with fresh fuel. We got a new carburetor. Well, new to this car carburetor. Need some adjusting stuff, but I think it'll run. There's no brake fluid in the in the uh, master cylinder, so I'm just got the mercy brake rigged up. Uh, as you can see from the interior, it does need some work. Needs a headliner, stuff like that. Overall, it's in good shape. Floor pans in the back are both good. I went through it. Passenger floor pan is gone. Dash pad or top of the dash is no good, but the dash itself is pretty good shape. Look at the old controls and stuff. We'll go over that when we get the drive. First of all, let's go ahead and get these windows open because I think we're going to get it started hopefully drive down the road so uh, let's see events oh forgot it says this is a vent window there's a knob oh man your windows it's good stuff though look at the thunder breaks on the door it's good stuff uh, overall doors in good shape look at that that's clean right there that needs some paint work I do see a little rust here not too bad though. That's not even all the way through there. It's just in there. Back window's in good shape. Make sure that top needs to be replaced. The lights are pretty good. Get up under the car a little bit there. You'll think that's not it. It doesn't look too bad. Uh, I do have this trunk thing. It's inside the trunk. Can see it nope there's a little lever back here if you can push up pull the trunk open now here's the piece to replace to put back in but i don't have a key i'll show you i don't have a key for the ignition either i got it kind of rigged up the original mirror that says night and i tv that's funny uh let's see these pretty good shape there's some water right there. I need to get that cleaned up. We don't want this rusted out. No batteries or Bondo. All this needs to be kind of fixed up. Uh, that weather shield just gone, of course. Now, it will need a new main trunk pan. Pretty much gone through. There's some stuff back there that could be for the rear air or something. I'm not sure. We'll go through that wiring and figure it out. Let's see. No rust on that side. Top. Yeah, still junk. Let's open this hood. Let's look at the windshield. Pretty much gone. Need to be replaced. This front bumper is pretty good shape. You got a little bend there. But overall, it's in good shape. This paint can use some definite cleaning. And then, uh, probably no saving, but that's okay. So I got the battery charged up, got it in there. Got this poly carburetor into it. Got the fuel off clean, as you can see. There's no air compressor, but the AC lines are still there. Um, there is some rust up under the battery. You can see right to the ground there. Um, Went and drained the coolant, put fresh coolant in it, drained the oil, put fresh oil in it. And this is just so I'm gonna start it up and try to go down the road here. Like I said about this master cylinder, there's nothing. Nothing in there at all. So we're gonna rile on that mercy brake. Now we're not going fast, we're not going far. We're just trying to see if we can go down the road and see how it does. Uh, I did kind of get it started up, so I know it does start. We're gonna see if it does run. Got the belt on there, power steering. There is fluid in there, it has been changed. Let's go in here, we'll get these windows down. 
see. Uh, let's see, that's for this. Uh oh. Does this not open up? See if we can't give it a little budge, see if it'll start. Oh, you can see it moving. There it goes. Let's see. Oh, that needs some grease. Oh. Window is down. All the trim for the window is good. Door panel does need replaced. Rocker panel panels are good. Floor pan is good on this side as well. And the rear. Let's get this back window down. Like I said, these seats are pretty much in good shape. Um, they do need recovered and probably some new cushion. But overall, it's in good shape. Here's all the gauges. I'll tell you, I don't have them working. And this steering wheel, you grab right here, and you can move it in that position when you go to drive. Push up over, move that position when you get out. But we want that position to start. Let's get this thing shut up. Hopefully, the light comes up. Shut the door. Yep. Uh, now, it does need new ignition, but I did hook this little thing up here. So we got the on switch. Boom, power on. I should. Just touch it like that. Alright, so we got an AM, FM, or just AM, excuse me, radio. Uh, it. does not work that's okay or the speakers aren't working I'm not sure what this is I'll have to figure that out we're looking it up and stuff uh, you got left and right air that's pretty much open to the vents kind of like it looks like a cockpit right here you got your lights you got your windshield wipers clock that works amp gauge works none of the other gauge are working it's your speedometer is supposed to light up it's not working uh, let's see nothing from the headlights so far Sounds pretty good overall, truthfully. I think we're gonna get this down the road now. I got the emergency, there's no brakes, but I have that's annoying. I've got the emergency brake set up where I push it, it'll spring back up. So I'm hoping that's enough to stop us. We're not going far. Uh, okay, I'm pull it over, right? But look at this dash, man. That's a pretty good shape. Console, a dash, and everything. Steering wheel's good, no horn. No blinkers yet. That's okay, we can fix all that. It does need a headliner, like I said before. There is rear air in this car. Okay, so. Oh, no brake. Let me use the emergency brake. I forgot. Reverse. Let up off of it. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Right through the floor. And our brakes aren't stopping us. Right through the floor there. Ooh. So, I'm going to see if I can video this while I'm driving here, so y'all just kind of bear with me. And the brakes are stopping us. Said I wouldn't, oh yeah, wouldn't drive fast. Hey, look at that, we are on the road. Ooh, that carburetor needs some adjusting. Probably coils, spark plugs, wires. Coming up on the stop sign, I'm allowed the gas here. See if I can't slow it down with this emergency brake. And stop. Now I am putting my foot on the regular brake to uh, see if I can't uh, make a brake light come on so I'm rear it, but ain't nobody really coming. So.
park, park does hold. So, turn the switch off. Well, folks, it's gone. Done and sold it. Didn't have no time to work on it. <laughs>